If you're using Adobe Illustrator, here are a few keyboard tricks and tips that you'll find useful. Command C copies a selected object. Command V pastes the copied object. The selection tool is always accessed with the keyboard shortcut V. So for instance, if you're using another tool like the type tool, for instance, you can see how my cursor changed. To get back to the selection tool, the keyboard shortcut V always gets me back to the arrow pointer, which is the selection tool. Holding the shift key down when moving objects constrains movement to up, down, left, right, and 45 degrees. Holding the shift and option key when moving objects constrains movement to up, down, left, right, 45 degrees plus makes a copy of the object. You can see how the cursor changes to the double arrow, indicating that it's making a copy. Holding the shift key down when scaling objects maintains the object proportion. You can see what happens if I fail to hold the shift key down when scaling an object. This is useful for, for some applications, but not all. Also, a quick keyboard shortcut is Command Z, which is undo. Holding the shift and option key when scaling an object maintains the object's proportion and scales from its center. You can see the difference from scaling from its center versus scaling from the corner. This is useful, useful in some applications. You want to scale from the center. The keyboard tricks and tips that I just showed you are for Adobe Illustrator on a Mac. If you're running a PC, most of them will still work. If you're using CorelDRAW, it has its own keyboard tricks and tips and shortcuts. You'll have to check your software documentation. Don't let that worry you, though, because most graphics applications have very, very similar uh, keyboard shortcuts.